What is up guys, this is PMT Gaming and thank you for watching this video. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new around here, smash that subscribe button down below. Make sure to press the little bell next to it to get all the notifications when I upload the video. So let's re just review the, the quick update that we can that we just get got from the Clash Royale, the Legend Arena and the Hog Mountain. Uh, well, the old Legend Arena has been renamed for Hog Mountain. Not sure if that's the best name and uh, whether they're going to put the Hog Rider in there because it would make sense to have the Hog Rider in the Hog Mountain to be unlocked. So I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Uh, the Legend Arena, the new mystical sort of temple space sort of arena looks really cool. I really like it. And then after that, there's an end game that you can't go and you can't get any other arenas. And you have leagues. You have Challenger 1, Challenger 2, 3, uh, one, Master 1, Master 2, Master 3, and then Champion, cha Grand Champion, and Ultimate Champion. Not sure who's going to get that. But if you do get an Ultimate Champion uh, chest, that's 500 cards, and you get a guaranteed guaranteed um, legendary as you can see in this uh, value four, four times value for 24 pounds for 100 100,000 coins uh, one legendary 50 epics and 250 rares so not a bad choice but I'm not going for it because that's quite um, quite sort of you know expensive if I, I would say so let's just try and Go into a battle. I might just swap up, swap up different decks. I'll, I'll go with the golem deck first. See how it goes. If we don't, if we don't win, don't win, right? So let's try and get to ten likes on this video. That would be insane, guys. If you like this video, please leave a like um, and comment down below. Say hi. I will always, always um, say hi back. So okay. So this is the new arena. It looks really, really cool. I like it. I like it. It's just sort of creates this mystical thing about this Clash Royale. Um, you don't really see the trophies coming out the the right hand side. He's gonna he's gonna arrow that. Um, not sh probably a really good arrow. He he's gonna probably gonna take our, our tower out just like that. And uh, that's unfortunate. That's un really unfortunate. Uh, minions for the skeletons again. I'm not sure if that's the best way to to play that. And that's not the best start, guys. Um, I I got I gotta say that's not the best start. So hopefully the minion is going to take out this Valkyrie and do some damage to the right hand side tower. There we go. The right hand side tower is down to 1700. Not too bad at all. And we managed to take out this Valkyrie as well. So, right. We need to sort of improve our placement, if I should say. Yeah, placement would, would need to be improved a lot. So I'm going to arrow that Ice Wizard and the minions. Great value because we got the tower as well. Uh, he's probably going to put his, um, his Elite Barbarians in a minute. Okay, he's got he's got his uh, goblin barrel. That's okay. We can we can deal with that. I think we can take it out. Just um, not the best, but we, we managed to took it out. So okay, right. He's gonna fireball. That's that's great value. Uh, I'm not gonna not gonna lie. So I'm gonna put my, my golem in front of the ice wizard. Hopefully he can do some damage. Come on, come on, come on. Ice wizard, stay behind. There we go, my man. Uh, I'm gonna put the, the minions for this um, Valkyrie and the. Okay, he's gonna he's gonna arrow that. That's unfortunate. But look at this. His tower is down to eight hundred now, so we're not doing too bad, considering we started really badly. So we do have a Valkyrie to deal with. Uh, so I'm not sure how to deal with that, but I I, I kind of got an idea. So I'm gonna arrow all of that nonsense, get it out of the way, and okay, I'm just gonna leave it. She's gonna get one shot on the, on her tower, two shots on her tower. Okay, that's bad. <laughs> so we still haven't used a graveyard spell. I didn't. I really didn't get didn't really get a chance to actually use it. So. I'm going to put my golem on the left hand side. He's going to fireball us, uh, which is a great fireball. Uh, we're going to put the minions for the um, for the ice wizard. Then we're going to put the graveyard spell for the golem uh, with, to sort of support the golem. Okay, he's, he's got his uh, Valkyrie down, which is great play by him. And then we just need to fire, we need to arrow all of that. And we're going to throw the Goblin Gang for the Elite Barbarians quick. There we go, nice. Um, we're going to throw the Ice Wizard and the Minions for the Goblin Barrel. And he's going to win this game just like that. That's unfortunately, guys. We lost the first game in the new arena. That's annoying. And um, that's really annoying, actually, guys. I hate, I hate losing. So we lost against a level 10 as well. So not, not the best start. So there's new cards coming out, and um, you know, we'll see how it goes. So okay, I'm gonna uh, use this deck, the arrow bait deck. Um, 
just instead of the Inferno Tower, I'm going to put the um, Hog Rider in because I love my Hog Rider. I love Hog Riders and just in general. So, you know, right, level 11 threads. Uh, we need to do something. We need to start winning. Uh, he's at 3,800, so he, he's quite high up there. Well, he's quite low, to be honest, considering we've been playing against, you know. So, okay. We have the Miner and the Goblin Barrel going to work, doing a ton of damage to that right-hand side tower. What a great start that was. So, we're going to put the Princess just sort of in the middle, on the other side. So, he has to sort of do something about it. So, I'm going to log all of that back as well. Hopefully, the Prince is going to take out the Wizard. Come on, take it out. There we go. Nice. So we, we managed to play it really well there. So I'm gonna put the hog rider on the right hand side, on the left hand side. I'm gonna throw a miner on his elixir collector this time, and uh, we're gonna take out his elixir collector nicely. We do have three musketeers coming towards us, which could cause us a, a lot of problems. So I'm gonna put the skeleton army. I'm gonna zap all of that. Boom! There we go. We should be able to take it out. Come on! He zapped it, and I'm gonna leave it as it is. He did do some damage, but we're winning. We're, we're doing well. Okay, right, so I'm gonna throw my goblin barrel, a short one, uh, just to see what how he does it. There we go, okay, not bad, not bad at all. These these goblins managed to get like four, four or five stabs, which is great. Um, oh no, not the royal giant, not the royal giant, come on. I'm gonna throw the miner on this ice wizard, come on, take him out. Um, there we go, nice. We're gonna take him out just because we need to get get rid of him. I'm gonna throw my hog rider as well. I'm gonna log it everything down. Um, again, not sure if that's the best play because obviously he didn't put his uh, barbarians down. So the miner is actually gonna do some some work to that um, wizard. We're gonna throw the skeleton army. We're gonna throw the princess um, to help out, and then I'm gonna zap. I wanna zap that wizard just to sort of get rid of him. He's they're going to take out our, our right-hand side tower out, which is not good at all. Not good at all. I'm going to throw my miner and the goblin barrel again together. See how he reacts. He's probably going to zap. Okay, he's not going to zap. The goblin barrel is going to actually take out that tower pretty much. Um, we're going to log those wizards back a, mi a, a little bit. And then we're going to throw the princess to take out these wizards. We're going to throw the skeleton army for the barbarians. Uh, we're going to throw the minion horde on the um, Royal Giant, and then we're gonna throw the Miner and the Hog Rider all together, do, doing some work, come on. We're gonna throw the second Princess down, uh, we're gonna throw, okay, the, the Wizard actually can't even take our minions out, which is perfect for us. Uh, skeleton Army, go to work, do some work, come on. I'm gonna log all of those Barbarians back, and then well, this should be game, as long as he doesn't do anything else. There we go, managed to take out this uh, Royal Giant, and we won the first game on this video. Finally, guys, finally managed to win this game, so it's, be, it's been a tough one. Tough one, definitely. So, we won the first game in the new arena, we're 3,900, so we're not too bad, I guess. Um, local, how are we doing in local? Um, I think we can actually get to, like, local 200 really quickly if we actually manage to win some games. Clans, local-wise, we're third. Oh god, we need to um, get some trophy pushing going, guys. Because um, you know, I was my clan was first for a very long time, and we need to make sure we first again at some point in the future. So, you know, we'll see how it goes, right? Okay, so I'm gonna put the princess at the my side, um, just my side. I'm just fixing my hat because it looks pretty shit, but that's all fine. I don't really care. So Hog Rider Princess. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna log all of that because why not? There we go. Managed to get the uh, skeletons and that's perfect play. Um, okay, I'm gonna leave that Mega Minion. I'm gonna zap those minions, take them out, and then we're gonna throw the Miner and the Goblin Barrel together. See what how he reacts now. See what he does. Come on. Oh, we got, he's gonna arrow that. That's okay. We do have a minions. The minions can cause. Chaos guys um, Because he did, he did use his arrows now. I might push the left hand side uh, With the minions and the hog rider. I'm gonna throw the minions on this uh, miner and See what he does. I'm gonna throw my hog rider in front of it and uh, Is he gonna do anything? I'm gonna zap that uh, All of those skeletons uh, and look at this the minions are going to work and the left hand side tower is dead 
this is this is what I'm talking about this about this deck. This deck it's been one of my favorite deck my favorite decks in a while. There's three people watching. I think um, my clan mates are watching, or there could be somebody else. So we're gonna take his right hand side tower as well. Oh, all good. So I think it's gonna be another win, guys. Okay, he's got his lava hound ready, ready to go. That's okay. We're not we're not too fussed about that. Um, I'm gonna put, put my princess to start things off. Just to start shooting. Okay, I'm gonna put my skeleton army for this um for this graveyard, and then we're gonna put the minions uh, for this lava hound. Again, I don't know if that's the best play. Uh, we need to make sure we zap all of that. And okay, look, that's not bad, not bad at all. I'm gonna throw my hog rider, my miner, and my goblin barrel all together. Let's see what he, what we can do. Get get this out of this. And not the best play, but that's okay. We are sh we should win this game. We've got four people watching on on this well this this match, and we're gonna throw the minion horde for this naked graveyard. We're gonna throw the skeleton army, and uh, we're gonna leave that tower actually, guys. We I'm just gonna leave it. Throw the hog rider in. Throw the goblin barrel in. We should win this game nice and easily. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna log all of that as well, and. Uh, you know, I'm not really too fussed about this. He's def he's trying to defend as as hard as he can, but that's not gonna that's not gonna help him. So skeleton army. Oh god. Okay. I'm gonna zap that as well. Get the get rid of those skeletons. And look at this. He won't won't be able to take our tower. Two nil. Two bloody nil. I don't care. That's two wins. Uh, there we go. We're finally winning some games. So thirty nine fifty four. So far, I'm loving this arena. Like, if we get the challenger, that's not too bad. We get 10 epics and 50, 50 rares? Damn. Wow, that's not bad, not bad at all. So, okay, uh, we need to fourth, we need to get to as high trophy as possible because, you know, like I've been sitting at 4,000, 4,100 4, trophies for way too long, guys, way too long. So, okay, I'm playing against Eric Kern in from Innocent Candy, uh, Miner. And goblin barrel together let's see see what he does he's probably gonna zap um okay elite barbarians that's okay because the goblin barrels are actually gonna do some work uh to that tower so i'm gonna put my princess i'm gonna put my skeleton army right there come on take out these elite barbarians there we go nice and then we're gonna throw the skeleton the hog rider into the play oh why are you going to the right i don't know why is he going to the right no idea He's actually gonna take. They're gonna take our hog rider out. That's unf that's really annoying because I, I don't think he's gonna go to the right. I guess I needed to do pork push. Um, if you don't know what pork 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 push it pork push is, is uh, you sort of um. Put the hog rider on the right hand on the very very, very right side, and uh, have a troop push into the right hand side so he can't go over to the left into the middle. So I'm going to throw the, hog, the goblin barrel right there. I'm going to throw the princess for the giant skeleton, for, for the royal giant. And then I'm going to put the skeleton army for this uh, royal giant, hopefully take him out. And I'm going to put the hog rider in as well. Uh, the hog rider should not go to the furnace this time. The hog rider is actually going to go straight to the, to the right hand side tower. Take that tower out as well, pretty much. That tower is down to 239. That's not too bad. He's going to log. That's a wasted log. So, you know, we're doing good. We're not doing too bad. Uh, we need to get ready for his um, for his elite barbarians somewhere. Um, not too fussed. Not really too fussed about that. Um, okay, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna wait. I'm just gonna put the miner there, and then we're gonna put the princess right there to take out that. We didn't really manage to do that. That's okay. So we're gonna throw the goblin barrel and the hog rider in the middle. Come on. There we go. Focus it. Oh god, I thought I got the tower is gonna focus on the got hog rider. That's okay. We're doing fine. I'm gonna put the skeleton army for these elite barbarians. We're gonna we're gonna log all of that back, and uh, that's well defended, guys. We defended it really, really well. I'm gonna put the minion horde on the on the um, musketeer there, and I'm gonna throw the miner and the um, goblin barrel on the uh, royal giant, and we should be good. Uh, obviously, he's, he just took us left hand side tower. That's okay. We can deal with that. I'm gonna throw my hog rider in. Um, take out the furnace. We've got a lot of skeletons coming towards us. That's okay. 
and the princess is going to deal with it we need to take out this right left hand side tower minion horde for this um, royal giant come on take him out as soon as we can there we go nice um he's gonna fireball nothing not the best fireball again uh we're gonna throw the miner we're gonna throw the goblin barrel we're gonna we're gonna log all of that back and uh let's see what he does okay goblins are going to work guys i'm gonna throw my princess and the second princess as well guys um i'm gonna throw my miner and the princess is actually gonna take out with her splash damage and that's three wins guys three wins in a row we've lost the first one and we're doing well i don't care about losing the first one so right okay so we, we won the two we won we lost the first one uh with the golem deck and we won th three in a row with a nice simple zap bait deck as you may know i'm what probably this is probably my favorite deck to use my zap baits are just insane so right let's go into one more battle let's try and get to over four thousand trophies get into the challenge of one and uh, league get it in there and uh, get things going so okay we're gonna put the princess at the back start things off nice and nice and easy he's got his uh, wizard that's okay we might throw the miner now I'm gonna throw my goblin barrel just to sort of put some pressure on him he's gonna fireball my princess that's okay he's gonna zap that um, I think this time to do a sick push miner skeletons and a hog rider Oh, I don't know. That's the best push. The Hog Rider is actually going to get to the tower with the Miner and do a ton of damage. Wow. That tower is down to 1,300. So we did well. Uh, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to log all of that. Managed to get the Fire Spirits as well. Uh, unfortunately, League Barbarians are going to get on, onto our tower, which is not great. But, you know, there's nothing we can do. I'm going to throw my Goblin Barrel to the left a little bit. So he, like, maybe messes him up. There we go. Boom. That's, that's what I wanted to do. Great throw of the goblin barrel because that's managed to do like 400 damage, so it's all good. So the princess is actually going to take care of the right hand side tower, left hand side tower. We're going to zap those minions, uh, they're going to be taken out by our tower. Oh, good. I'm going to throw a miner, I'm going to throw the hog rider together and see what that does. Is he going to put elite barbarians? No, he won't. Um, Okay, he's gonna zap that and look at this. We actually managed to do a ton of damage to that uh, to the right hand side tower as well We're gonna we're gonna throw the princess for these minions. All good. All good Um, The left hand side tower is actually one log away from actually getting taken out. So I'm not too worried about that as well Um, The princess got one shot on the right hand side right side right hand side tower. That's okay 1300 to take that out as well. I'm gonna throw the goblin barrel just sort of make him use like a zap or something Oh, okay. Okay, just let me do let me do my thing. Uh, I'm gonna throw a skeleton army, split them up, sort of thing. Uh, I'm gonna throw a miner on the right hand side. I'm gonna log all of that the wizard and the um, the golem and the tower. Um, that's not that's not being taken out yet. I'm gonna put, throw the princess for these um, for the minions. I'm gonna zap that. Uh, I'm gonna throw a skeleton army. Um, for the elite barbarians and that's not good guys not that's not good at all uh actually we in we're in a lot of trouble i'm gonna throw a miner on the right hand side we're gonna throw oh god no we're gonna lose this game guys we lost this game just because we couldn't defend the big push damn it oh god okay right um i think this deck could be improved by having an Inferno Tower or Inferno Dragon instead of the Skeleton Army. So this is a full legendary deck. So I'm going to try out this last game with the Inferno Tra Tower, with Inferno Dragon, and uh, we'll see how it goes. We'll try and um, use that correctly. So, okay, level 11, 3900. Okay, he's got his uh, Elixir Pump. That's okay, we're going to throw our Miner in. And uh, start things off. Come on, minus. Focus on the elixir pump. There we go. Nice. Get a couple of shots. That's fine. Uh, okay. The princess is actually going to take out this. This. Um, ice golem. The minions are going to take out the. The elite barbarians. And then we're going to throw the hog rider with the minions and the uh, inferno dragon all together. 
doing doing work. That tower is down, guys. I think that tower is gonna be down. Um, I don't see him defending it. Oh, okay, so he's, he defended pretty well, I guess. No, no, he didn't. He just sort of lost 2,700 damage on that tower, so he did not defend it well. So we're gonna throw the goblin barrel on the right on the left hand side um, for that elixir pump. He's gonna zap that. That's okay. We're gonna throw the miner now. Do something about it, my man. There we go. The miner's actually doing work. There we go. The miner's gonna take out that elixir pump. He needs to do something. I'm gonna put my princess for this right hand side tower. He's gonna log it. That's okay. I'm not too fussed about that, to be honest. Okay. Right. What's he gonna do now? I don't know. I know what idea. Split my minions. Oh god. Um, Hog Rider to distract the elite barbarians. And then we're gonna lock, log the elite barbarians as well. And look at this. That's that's the that's the play that you want to see every single time, guys. I'm gonna throw my miner. Probably not the best because obviously um, we could use it to take out the elixir pumps. He's gonna zap that. Um, that's a waste of a zap, guys. So I don't know. We'll see. So I'm gonna throw my princess. No, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna throw my goblin barrel for that elixir pump, and then we're gonna zap. Okay, he's gonna log it. That's okay. We're gonna throw the princess now. Oh, giant. Okay, that's a perfect uh, situation to actually use our our inferno dragon. We're gonna log that all of that back. We're gonna we're gonna zap it as well. Uh, we're gonna throw the miner in there. We're gonna throw the, another princess. Come on, come on, come on. We need to take all, all of that out. Minion horde for these, um, for the um, musketeers. We're gonna log that those elite barbarians back. Um, that was a tough defense, but we managed to actually defend it. We should be able to win this game, guys, just in time to you know to win this game. So okay, we're gonna throw the zap. We're gonna throw another princess, and that's gonna be a game. Um, wow. If he showed the, the Three Musketeers a lot earlier, I think he would have won the game. But that's his own mistake. So that's a, a bit of a long video, guys. Sorry about that. If you guys enjoyed this video, please leave a like down below. And if you're watching this video right now, damn. Love you guys. One sec. Love you guys. So, you know what? I'm going to give it one more time. One more try to get to 4,000 trophies. And get to Challenger 1. Um, I want to get to that Challenger 1. And then we'll see. We'll see. I want to try. It gave... This new update gave me sort of a bit of a more passion to play this game a lot more uh, because I want to I want to push trophies now I want I want to get to that challenger you know as, as, as high as I can obviously I'm a level 11 so I can't get too high up uh, because of my card level but we'll try our best so I'm gonna zap those that goblin gang because why not uh, there we go we got we got the miner he's gonna he's gonna use his arrows so I'm gonna throw the miner and the goblin barrel together see what he does. And I'm gonna log it all, all of that because I knew he was gonna use the skeleton army. Uh, come on, get rid of that. There we go, nice. So we managed to do some sort of damage, not the best again. So he does have a zap bait deck. So I'm not sure how the Inferno Dragon's gonna work in this deck. So we'll see. So I'm gonna throw the Hog Rider, see what he defends with. Okay, he's got the Inferno Dra uh, Tower. We're gonna zap the Inferno ta Tower, try and get. Like a, a hit on that tower, but I don't think that's gonna work. Yep, that's not enough. Right. I feel like we're in trouble, guys. Okay. Um, that's, I think that's really good to be honest. Inferno Dragon, perfect use for for the Lava Hound. Then we're gonna throw the Princess, and we're gonna log all of that back, uh, just because why not? Um, we're good. We managed to defend it really well, actually. We're gonna throw the Miner. We're gonna throw this uh, goblin barrel all together. And where's the skeleton army? Okay, that's okay actually. That's not too bad. I'm gonna zap those uh, minions because they're level 12. The level 12, they, they're gonna get to the tower and they're gonna shred the tower. So we 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 actually winning. So so good. We just need to make sure we don't use the inferno dragon for other things rather than the lava hound because obviously the lava hound is like the main sort of tank for him. Uh, so we're going to put the princess to get some more chip damage done on that tower. Come on. There we go. He's used his inferno tower, which is great. That's what we want to see. I'm just going to wait. I, I, I really don't... I can't be messing about. So I'm going to throw my, I'm gonna throw my minion horde because we need to. Uh, I'm going to throw my miner. 
I'm gonna log all of those back. That's okay. And the miner's gonna actually start doing some chip damage. Inferno Dragon for this Lava Hound. We're gonna throw the Princess. Uh, we're gonna zap those minions. Hopefully the Princess is actually gonna take it out. There we go, nice. We're gonna throw the minion horde for these um, for these minions. And we're gonna throw the log with the Hog Rider. That's, that did not work too well because I was thinking of him getting a um, the skeleton army out ready and I thought he might use it. So we're gonna throw the miner and throw the goblin barrel together. And we're gonna get rid of the zap. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm gonna zap that. There we go, there we go. nice. We didn't work to that tower now, guys. We're gonna throw the Inferno Dragon uh, on this Lava Hound. We need to do something. Come on. There we go. Minion Horde for this Miner. We're gonna throw this um, Miner in, in there as well. I'm gonna log all of that back. And can we win this game, guys? Can we win it? There we go. Boom. 4,000 trophies, guys. And we're back. Reaching Challenger 1, finally. So... Not bad at all. There we go. We've got a nice little trophy thing. Ooh, I like that. I like it a lot. So it shows the little draft chest that you get. So I'm going to screenshot that. Why not? And uh, ooh, wow. Okay. So we get all these sort of different league avatars or logos. So every league you get, every different league you get, so you'll get a different logo. So it's not too bad. Uh, it looks really cool. And as you can see, it's right there. Right there, looks really nice. So we've, we're at 4,012 4, trophies, back in 4,000 uh, crew. So hashtag, if, you, if you're still watching this uh, video, you know what? Leave a comment down below saying hashtag 4,000 squad. Hashtag 4,000 squad, it should be on the screen right now. Leave a comment down below and uh, I'll give you a little shout out in, in the next video. So, right, yeah, it's been your boy PNT, PNT Gaming and I hope you guys enjoyed this video because I personally did. New things in Clash Royale, a lot of exciting things. Sorry for a very long video, but yeah, it's, it's been it's been fun. So I'll see you in the next episode. Peace.